Hey. <laughs> it is I, uh, Unalia, again with another vlog. Yeah. Hey everyone, this is Unalia. Hey. Hey everyone, this is Unalia. Hi. Hello everyone, this is Unalia. Hey. Badass computer chair in the computer chair. <laughs> computer chair. <laughs> Anyways, I'm gonna sit here in the sun and get sunned. Oh, sun. Oh yes. Hey guys, I am back again. It is 6.47, 6.48 something. And I am just getting off work. I was... Oh my god, they wanted me to stay later. Because they didn't have a verifier. So I was their verifier. And I will tell you, it was really, really, really ridiculous. Oh god. So ridiculous. Do I need money? I don't think I need money. No, everything's up. Oh, thank God. Wait, that's not up. staff parking lot because um yeah I just do I'm making sure I don't hit pedestrians break today and our lunch break actually no not an hour lunch break it was 30 minutes my bad 30 minute lunch break which was you know good I was happy but I don't I, oh my god, so much walking today. I have done so much walking today. It is ridiculous. Okay, oh, of course I would miss the light. be this tired but I, I am all I all I want to do right now is watch for people walking across the freaking room and they shouldn't be holy shit hi guy sudden guy cash box my till and then I forgot to give someone their receipt and they needed it so I had to flag down a guy and one of the guys in the back behind me 
to go grab her and give it to her. And, uh, oh my God. So then they pulled me off the register and they put me in as a, uh, as a, um, verifier. They taught me how to do that. Which is really, really easy. And, yeah. I just felt really bad today because they kept pulling me and putting me places. I hated it. And then, uh, yeah, it was just it was ridiculous. talks to me at work they oh shit they only talk to me if they need a signature sign this sign that what the hell what are we doing jeep come on now so uh, anyways they only talk to me when they need my signature and that is pretty much it they don't talk to me about anything else. Your stupidity is gonna make me miss the fucking light. God dang it. God. Damn it. I would be eating right now. I would be so eating that right now. God, I'm so hungry. All these people walking by with food. I'm hungry. I'm so hungry. I've never been to Takogi. What is the hell is Takogi? Takogi. 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 I don't know. Oh, uh, yeah. uh, uh, gosh. Is it weird for me to be doing these vlogs every single day, you know? Driving with Unalia. She takes you all places. Sadly, you can't see where I'm going. Wish you could, but you can't. Oh. You would just get over, wouldn't you? You best be, because I want to get home. I want to sink, 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 sink my teeth into something good. Delicious. My parents should have gotten me some supper. Hope to God that they got back home with it. <coughs> <coughs> and I just now started coughing, which I don't know why. I do not know why. And it is sprinkling. Why the hell is it sprinkling? Oh my God. No. Please don't pray. truck is going to be in, in my parking spot. Yep, yep. I know it. I just know it. It will be. And I don't want to be behind this truck. I keep it over. Because, yeah, these people are flying. Because I keep it over. They're flying. Oh my god. This truck. SNL. Sorry, Night Live. I don't know what the fuck you're spelling on SNL. 
personnel, people. Is it still sprinkling? Yep, it's still sprinkling. Why must it sprinkle? Oh wait, there's a pool up there. I'm gonna look at. <sighs> Mr. Dragonfly, I would get out of the rain. Fly away. Damn it, I'm hungry. I want food. I want food. I need food. I need food. Like a sneeze. Alright, 
to go get her fucking breakfast because I won't have fucking time. Swear. Go get me breakfast. I need medicine. Get your own, damn it. Good, Dad's not here. I can get in my usual parking spot. Of course, I told her right at work that I needed to leave at 8 a.m. I'm going to be at work at 8 a.m. Home, guys. This has been a lovely session with driving with Unalia. I hope y'all enjoyed. I will see y'all later and I'm going to go eat now. Bye bye. Hey guys, I'm back. I've noticed that I'm going repeatedly back to my power shot elf 135 which I have in my hand right now to vlog with and I'm not using the other camera anymore I don't know why but what I've been wanting to do lately is to paint and if I can find the old picture of what I did back in high school. Please forgive me if I tilt y'all towards my boobs. Um, oh there it is. Oh that was fast. So, here. This is the painting I did back in high school of this weird fox type of thing um you can see the ears right here and then this is like this weird nose part of it i was just being whatever and then it's got this weird little snout as you can see it's weird it's it's this odd little box thing and i only used three or four different colors and he's like jumping through the forest and stuff like that I don't really know where this thing came from or how I did it but I did it in like a day and a half or so and then I ran out of time and had to start another project um this weird little tail thing so this is, I did this with a ruler. I was just drawing random stuff. And, um, yeah. <laughs> it turned out this, like this, right here. And it was just really, really weird. Um, I'd never done anything like this before. So... Um, yeah. It's really weird. Kind of want to do something like that again since I'm now older and I know what I'm doing. Because back in high school, I was experimenting with things. I didn't know what the hell I was doing. I didn't know what I wanted. Um, and most of all, I, I just didn't know. <laughs> I didn't, I didn't understand. So, I'm planning on getting some thick paper. I don't have any more. And I want to draw something on it. I might have any more. I might or might not. I don't know. Um, wow, that thing's ruined. Okay, is this the 
paper that I want. Yes, this is the paper that I want. All right, so I have this big paper and I'm going to take it and I'm, it says it won't yellow or fade, but that's bullshit it is. Um, because you can actually see which part has been out in the sun, which hasn't. So, um, yeah. I'm going to take this and I'm going to draw something on it. Um, if y'all want to see that, then, um, cool. I honestly don't know what I'm going to draw on this. Or paint on it, actually, I should say. I don't know what I'm going to paint on it. And, um, yeah. <laughs> Oh, I need to get ideas, because uh, this is what I'm going to do tomorrow, because um, I haven't done this in so long, and I've been wanting to, so I've got plenty of newsprint paper, but that's not the kind of paper that I need. Um, I'm spitting everywhere, because I have a spit in everything. So I'm going to take the 70 grams paper. Yeah. I think my parents are home. Oh, I hope they brought me a snack. I'm going to get ideas from everyone and I will come back with y'all. So yeah, I'll be back later. Bye. Hey everyone. How are y'all? I have a few things to discuss with y'all. So my day started out as it was okay. My oh shit! Hello, Herb. Just fell off the curb. My boyfriend called me. Co. Not called me. Texted me. Sorry, but he texted me. And he pretty much said, "I can't stand this anymore. I need help. My depression has gotten to me too much, and he couldn't." So, basically the stress from, oh shit, where am I going, oh my god, whoa, okay, I almost went onto some, someone's yard, um, his, the pressure from my parents and depression and stuff like that had gotten to be too much to him, too much for him. pissed off about it or not. 
You don't know if I'm going to be pissed off or not. You just thought I would. I mean, I don't hate her as much anymore. But I get pissed when I don't get told shit. Him not telling me made me even more pissed off than, than him telling me. So, um, yeah, I pretty much flat out told him, how dare you keep this from me? You don't keep shit like this from your other half at all, ever. That's, that's like holding secrets away that's very important. Even if nothing happened, doesn't, doesn't matter if something I mean, you gotta tell me anyways. It's... I'm trying to think of what the word is, but I can't think of it anymore. So, um, that happened. And... I'm heading to my cousin's house to help her box stuff up. My... My ex and friend... Or, my ex slash friend, Derek texted me, uh, asking if I was okay, and how I was, and stuff like that, I'm in the wrong lane, damn it, I should be in the right lane, and I told him I was fine, everything was good, so, also this morning, I woke up, um, my, our water was muddy, it still is, and we don't know what the hell's going on. There's something busted somewhere, and we don't know. Like, there's no water seeping out of the ground yet, anywhere, and we don't, we don't know. So, um, yeah, my hair is clean-ish. Ugh, I hate it. I don't like the feeling of this. But, yeah, um, that was my day. I had 12 kids running around on Sunday school. 12. Then I had three for church, three or four for church, and that wasn't too bad. So, yeah. sad that we broke up and stuff, but it's like a weight was lifted off me, because I was worried, I was more worried about him than myself. My depression and, and shit wasn't as bad. I always kept it in check. I always knew how to get over it and get past it and move on and stuff, but Side of the counter that I was working at, working on, on the cashier and stuff. I mean, some of the guys do hit on the cashiers. It's ridiculous. But, um, yeah. It's not that bad. But he's like, hey, are you taking? And I'm just like, it's none of your damn business. You still want to want to guess the game to see if I am? You know? And so then he's just like, well, your, your attitude is a whole lot different than the other people's. And I'm just like, my if I'm taken and, and stuff, my personal business is not yours. If I want it to be yours, I will tell you. I don't like fresh men. 
just so you know. Don't like them one bit. So don't hit on me. God. I'm sorry to be like the worst person put someone down and stuff if they are a freshman. But... I might look like I'm 18 or so and have this great job, but I'm really not 18 at all. <laughs> Hell, some of my... I am older than most of the, the girls at my work, at my other work, my church job. And one of them needed rum for a recipe that she has. And she's like, Jess, you could buy my rum. I'm like, yeah, I could buy your rum, but when someone gets rum or some alcoholic drink for someone else, they fucking abuse it. And then they go off and get drunk and stuff and do terrible things. And I don't want to be that person that buys rum and does and gets trouble for that. Um, yeah, and she's like, no, 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 I would never do that. I don't ever drink. I'm like, good, good for you. But I, I still don't trust. <laughs> don't make me feel bad. <laughs> so they're just like, oh, we're sorry. I'm sorry. I'm just like, no, it's fine. It's fine. But I'm just don't like to buy drinks for other people. Anyways, I am here at my cousin's house. And I think they left for dinner. I don't see their other car. So anyways, um... I will see y'all later. There's a cat in the, in the cat bed over there in the window. So anyways, I will see y'all later. Hope y'all enjoyed my, my vlog for Sunday. Because there was a lot of happening things. Um, yeah. So, some bad, some good. Some mostly bad, then good. Anyways, I will see you later. Uh, until later. Until next time. Bye. <laughs>